Hello there, YouTubers. It's me again. So, just a quick update here to show you where I'm at and uh, what's going on exactly. So, I got some starter here, tomato plant. This is my uh, romaine lettuce that I still got on a go. Not going too fast. This one didn't move at all. Uh, that's my P1. This one grow a little bit there. That's the cucumber right there. This one is another cucumber, this one too, and this one is my black IP. Black IP which has grown, 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 and grown to the point where it is super high. I got three lamp now, and it's almost at the six inch limit, if not already there. Anyway, here they got some nice little flowers right there and here too looking pretty good there we go I can't see good with this or not just gonna shut it down maybe it's gonna be better oh yeah a lot better so you can see that it's starting to grow you gotta look very carefully on this one and over here too, we got one there that is growing. So we started to grow some here. And on my other device, the aquaponic one, the water which was before at this level. So the foam was went down there so the cover not touching down. I'm gonna have to add some water after a week, so that's not too bad. And here you can see that the tomato plant, which is the same as those here, they didn't grow that much, but this one actually grew a lot, more leaf, as you can see here, a lot better. The cucumber is about the same as the other one I would say, not much difference. Uh, if I'm looking at the uh, lettuce, this is the romaine lettuce. It's actually grower growing a little bit faster here from what I can see. So, I don't know. I'm um, thinking uh, maybe uh, this metal what is better for some uh, type of uh, growing. Uh, and uh, maybe this one is uh, better for another type of growing. I'm actually wondering if aeroponic is not better for some specific type of roots. Uh, maybe uh, my spraying is not uh, good enough. Maybe I need to time it on a shorter day. Uh, maybe uh, 10 seconds, uh, 10 minutes. Uh, I actually got it on 30 minutes on, 30 minutes off. Uh, maybe that will make a difference. But uh, on a small root, it's definitely good. and. Uh, if they can retain water, it's even better, like those here. Let me just show you. So this is uh, celery, which I got from the store, and I planted here. It rooted, but as you can see the roots there, there is a little roots on the side, and the main one in the middle. Those type of roots are actually growing a lot better in aeroponic from what I could see. They're catching a lot faster, and the same thing as the black IP. And if you look at the root of this one here, it's only one big root. There's no small root, they're growing each side. But that's just only one big chunk of root. That's it, that's all. So I think those would grow better in this. So what I'm gonna do, I'm probably gonna switch this one into that one over there and uh, see what's happening. I'm pretty sure it's gonna grow faster. And I, I noticed that the same thing is going on with this. So the roots are only small, small roots. They don't have, because they're like round roots for the cucumbers, same thing. But the black IP there, they got the same roots as my celery. So they got little roots with small little roots on the side attached to the big one. So it looks like they're retaining the water a lot more faster on this and this and then all those there for our aerial ponic. So it could be better 
and this one and this one I didn't try to put one of uh, my tomato plant in this so I don't know what type of roots I didn't check them yet but maybe they got roots like uh, celery if it's the case then they would be better in the area upon it then again you need to test it so that's where I'm at and that's what I'm doing right now and uh, they got the same pH I test them every day and the same uh, amount of uh, solution in each one of them got the same thing so there's no change and there's no variation I make sure that maybe a couple of uh, variation in the ppm there but it's not uh, like drastically like uh, maybe five and five ppm difference in between the two of them but i'm not gonna go in there big big details now it's gonna make much of a difference anyway uh, that's where i'm at and uh, i wanted to show you that uh, my celery grow from the store actually worked really good on the area panic the other lettuce that i got there this the same as I'm growing here, uh, Romaine lettuce failed to grow. I don't know why. It just failed. And uh, that's what it is, and that's where I'm at. Alright, have a good day. Bye bye.